So uh, a tough night at the office with the boys out there. How, how are you feeling after that one? Yeah, disappointed. It's, uh, like you say, a tough day there. Uh, we didn't help ourselves. Uh, the errors and penalties we gave away in that first half just drained a lot out of us. But I thought coming in at half time, we, we were confident to go out in the second half and, and change things up. But unfortunately for us, we, we, we didn't manage to do that and we weren't able. I thought there were a lot of soft tries. Uh, towards the end of the, the second half, we uh, we were going set for set with him, but then we break first and against a team like St. Helens, you can't afford to do that, giving them the ball too easily. They're good enough to, like they scored, a couple of full length tries, so uh, that just puts you on the back foot straight away. They got that try just before half time as well, it was 18-0 at that point, but that seemed to really knock the stuffing out of us. Yeah, it's... It was a soft try, disappointing try to, to let in, so uh, it's very deflating when, when things like that happen. Uh, but like I said, we, we came in at half-time fully confident, uh, just didn't manage to put the, the, the wrongs right in the second half. In terms of the performance in the edit, lots of hard work in that second half, but we just couldn't really get over, get over the top of them. Yeah, that's it. We Like I say, we, we went set for set with them and we, we looked good, but we just... Uh, broke first. Um, we talk about getting in cycles and, and being the last one in there, uh, but unfortunately for us, we we made a few errors and, like I said before, against a good team like St. Helens, it, it costs you and you're on the back foot straight away with big guys like Walmsley, James Graham, um, just coming straight down the middle and it's it's hard when you're being backed up like that. And in terms of yourself, obviously your first game back, how did you, how did you find it? Yeah, putting the game aside uh, and the result, personally, felt great. Um, come through it on scale, the knee felt strong and good. And uh, just like to thank all the medical staff for, for all the work they've put in over this last year. Uh, it's been a long road, but I'm back and I felt good tonight. And where did the team go for me? Obviously, Wigan next up. Uh, just a case of, of, of putting that one to one side and, and getting back to what we know we can do well. Yeah, I think we've we've got to learn lessons. I thought there were similar traits from from last week against Huddersfield. Um, obviously, they managed to scrape our way through that one, but uh, lessons to be learned, and we've got to do it quickly. Because, like you say, another tough game next week against Wigan. And just finally, with uh, Alex Sutcliffe playing the centres there, um, young fella, he, he did well out there. Just unfortunate night for him. Yeah, he got a bit of a knock um, to his ankle first and then obviously with the with the head injury he had to go off but I thought he, he looked strong, uh, he didn't look out of place and I thought he had a good game up to, to going off.